my channel. I'm Cynthia Nee. If you're new, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So in today's video, I know I told you guys that I was going to do a home goods haul and here it is. You guys know if you watched my previous video that I went shopping for home decor. I went to Marshalls, I went to TJ Maxx, and I also went to Home Goods. Fortunately, I found everything that I needed at Home Goods. I didn't find anything at Marshalls, and I didn't really find too much at TJ Maxx either. But once I went to Home Goods, I found everything that I was looking for and then some. So, first of all, I am coming to you guys from my floor today because everything that I want to show you guys is like on the lower level. So, I wanted to just feel super comfortable, just it's just like a little chit chat slash haul, I guess. Or it's just a haul. It's just a haul, guys. It's no, no chit chatting. But anyway, so when I went to Home Goods, like I said, I found everything that I was looking for. I really went crazy. I spent over an hour in Home Goods. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I I just was so happy to be in there and just saw so many things, things that I didn't even buy. But a lot of the things that I did buy. So the things that I bought, I took the liberty of writing down the prices for you guys because of course I threw the receipt away. But I wrote down all the prices for you guys so that if you're interested in any of the items that I bought from Home Goods, you'll already know how much they cost. So the first item that I want to show you guys is this plant right here. Um, I was looking for some greenery because my mom got me into plants. I don't want any real plants. She has a green thumb. I don't. So I figured why not get a faux plant that's, you know, green and just brighten up the room. So I went and I saw this plant. This is actually one of the things that I was looking for when you guys saw me in the video looking at plants. This was one thing that I was looking for and Home Goods actually had it. It wasn't too big, it wasn't too small, it was just the perfect size and I love the little brown stand that it's on along with the plain sleep pot which brings out the greenery in the plant. And this was, oh, I did not throw the receipt away you guys. I still have it. So guys, this plant right here was $12.99 and I figured you probably can find a better price but like I said, I found everything that I needed in Home Goods, so I figured why not get it and it was pretty and it looks so cute on my little cubicle up there and you guys will see this in the background of a lot of my videos, probably in some of the series that um that you're gonna see some of my episodes you'll see this in the background but this plant was $12.99 so the next thing that i'm going to show you guys is something that i had been looking for for a while i actually went on shein's website because i saw that they had the little small glass vases with like um these pinkish looking flowers in them but I always tell you guys that I'm really skeptical about Shein because they're like a hit or miss company so I just prefer to actually go into a store home goods and pick up this flower these flowers and this is the flower like these are so so cute I love the square glass base and of course it's not anything in it like you could just see the stems of the roses but it's these ivory roses it probably looks white on camera but it's these ivory roses and i thought that this would be a cute little home decor also to put on top of my cubicle to put in the background when i'm making videos for you guys but I thought that this was so pretty for a long time. I was in Home Goods and it, they had so many different options. Like I was like, okay, do I want a colorful one? You know, do I want one that's like pink or do I want just a plain simple, which is why they call me Simply Me. But just a plain simple 
rose with like a clear vase and this was just perfect the other ones were a little too big for my liking but this one was the perfect size this was $16.99 and I know I know I know honestly guys I can DIY this to be honest but I just wanted to buy it because it was already made I didn't have to worry about making it although I do enjoy making things but I know I could have DIY this but I just decided that I wanted to buy it. And so, like I said, it was $16.99. So if you're interested in getting this, then um, now you know the price. So the next thing that I got, you can actually see in the background right here. Um, I was on Etsy. Like this just popped up one day for me. I don't know if it was because I was looking at home decor and it popped up like in Google. But it was like these um, books that were um the cover were, were was vogue but it wasn't real books it was just like a box but it looked like a book and it just so happened as i was moseying on through home goods i ran across this vogue book um and it was just like oh my gosh like it was meant to be because i was online just last night looking at something like this but it was it wasn't an actual book but this one, I'm going to go ahead and take it down for you guys. This one is an actual book. So not only is it a cute little decor to put, you know, just sit around, but you can actually read it. And this is the Vogue book, The Shoe. This is, this is about shoes. And you guys know how many shoes I have. And you guys haven't even seen my tennis shoe collection, so... It's not as big as my heel collection or my boot collection, but I have quite a few tennis shoes too. So be on the lookout for a tennis shoe collection coming soon. But anyway, this Vogue book was at Home Goods. It was the, no, I don't think it was the only one left. No, this particular one was the only one left, but they had another Vogue book, but I love this color. So I figured it would stand out in the room in my room in my cubicle so i had to have it and this book was 24.99 now i didn't care about it being 24.99 um that's a little expensive for a book that's probably not going to get read i mean maybe if i get bored enough then i'll read it but this literally is just for some decor this book probably won't get read but i will show you guys it does have like nice pictures and everything in the inside so if you are a reader and this book interests you it's $24.99 so we're gonna put that back right there now guys I did have some trouble um trying to stand this book up because it's so thick but we're gonna just keep it like that we're gonna keep it keep it like that all right so now these next two items that I'm going to show you guys, which is, I think, the last two items. No, it's not the last two items. I actually have more. So, these next two items that I'm going to show you guys, I had no plans on buying these. But, as I, like I said, as I was going through Home Goods for over an hour, this is what happens when you're just walking through a store for hours and you have the time to just go up and down every aisle and see what the store has this is what happens so this next item is like a geographic item i guess it's just i don't know i don't know i just saw it and i said oh i think that it looks so cute in my cubicle so it is this right here you guys i was blocking it but it's this item right here. I could take it out so that you guys can see it. But I thought this was so cool. Y'all know I'm into like artsy stuff. So I thought this was cool. And this was the last one that they had. So you know me. I don't know if y'all think like this. But I'm the type of person that says, oh my gosh, it's not going to be there. If I wait to get it and go back, I'm going to be disappointed because it's not going to be there. So I need to get it now. That's the type of person I am. Same thing with clothes. If I see something and I think everybody going to like it, I tell myself I need to go ahead and get it now. Stop procrastinating and get it because when I go back some weeks later or a week later, even a day later sometimes, it might be gone. So I got this little geographic statue or decor, whatever you want to call it. And this 
actually was $16.99 and I figured like I said why not it's different I like it and it fits perfectly in my cubicle so now the next item that I'm going to show like I said I had no intention on buying this particular item I don't know if you guys remember when I was walking down the aisle it was like all these glass vases and you saw like uh, it would look like a pink glitter ball and I think they also had gold well I bought two of the gold glitter balls two I, I don't know what got into me like I just was so overjoyed like I just wanted to buy everything and, and thought everything was so pretty and it these just were pretty so I just decided to get them and here they are this is one of them and you could just put this around your house or your apartment or whatever like it just sits there and just glistens like when the light hit it it's just so pretty so I got this one which is the smallest one and then I also got this one which is the biggest one and you know you just I decided that they would be cute together so and they fit perfect in my cube once again so the smallest one was $7.99 and the biggest one was $12.99 so guys I spent a good amount in home goods but I figured everything that I got I really really liked and I was going to utilize it so why not get it but if you guys are interested in these two items no they don't come together you have to buy them separately so like I said $7.99 for this one $12.99 for this one so guys last but certainly not least because I will probably be going back to home goods um like I said I found so many things that I like the last thing that I got which was actually the last thing that I saw when I was at home goods I actually was walking y'all know they set y'all up y'all know they set us up like when you're walking in the aisle I mean walking to go pay for your stuff they put specific things up at the front and they know you're not thinking about them like candy for for example you're not thinking about no candy but soon as you get up to that register and that candy sitting to the right or to the left of you now all of a sudden you want a piece of candy that's what happened with me with these next items so i have been looking for um black and white pillows and unfortunately i cannot find them anywhere like i know i can go on amazon and stuff like that but a lot of the times i'll be wanting things like right now like why wait for them to come in the mail or you know get them shipped when i can just go pick them up so anyway on my way to the register i came across these pillows and i believe these might be outdoor pillows but i'm gonna make them indoor pillows like because the way it feels like this feels like nylon material but i thought that these were so cute to put in the living room and it's this like cylinder one and they were the last two and the lady at the register she was like oh my gosh i love those pillows are these for indoor or outdoor and anyway so she just was asking me questions but like i said these are the last two pillows these pillows were $12.99 a piece they did not come as a set so just be mindful if you want both pillows you have to pay $12.99 for each so i decided to get them and they look so cute on the couch and the sofa i just i'm just pleased with everything that i got from home goods home goods has been my store since i first was introduced to home goods this video is not sponsored but home goods if you want to sponsor me if you want to sponsor your girl you can so that brings me to the end of this video guys i hope you all enjoyed this home goods haul until next time, I will see you in my next one. Bye.